Hey guys, um, welcome back to my channel, but if you haven't subscribed already, please go click that subscribe button down below and turn on my notification bell to get notified every time I post a video here on YouTube, and please go follow my beauty Instagram at underscore Haley's Beauty underscore, and excuse the braids for this video, I know my hair looks like really messy, I have messy braids in, but oh well, um, I still filmed for you guys. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and let's get into the video. Hey guys, um, here I am, messy hair and everything, kind of looking like a zombie, like I'm dead. But, um, today I am doing a, um, my fall makeup routine. Um, I haven't done a one since the spring, so I figured I should update you on what has been my favorite thing to do for fall. Um... Yeah, um, I know fall was just fry our, wait, what, 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 no, it turned fall two weeks ago, but I've been doing this for, like, probably more than just fall, like, about a month, a whole month of September, I'd say, but, um, yeah, and don't mind me, I am gonna be drinking some hot chocolate, because I'm loving this weather that we're currently having, it's currently, like, 60 degrees, and like the cold kind of 60 degrees, like not the spring type 60 degrees, like the actual cold 60 degrees where you need a sweater on. Um, this is still a little too hot. I'm going to burn my tongue if I drink this. Never mind. Um, I'm sorry if I seem a little off today. I'm just having kind of a hard day. I'm just like stressed and like, I don't know, like in a meh mood. You know what I mean? Like, I'm just not myself today. I'm just... You know, a little sad and having a hard day. I don't know why I'm sad. I just, I don't know. Life is just hard sometimes, guys. Um, it's just one of those off days for me. Um, anyway, enough with me blabbering. I should probably be doing my makeup while I'm talking like this. But, um, yeah, i just been kind of off lately for, like, the past month. It's just, I've been stressed with, um school like senior year like getting things ready for college and I've been just been super busy with work and I haven't feel like I haven't had time for just me time even though I do go to the gym and that's like my me me time but like I just started going it I actually I wasn't going to the gym for a while um I was mainly just staying home and chilling but then I feel like the and, or actually, well, chilling or working like crazy. Um, but then I need to, like, have an outlet for my stress and stuff because I feel like it's not, cause it is not good for me to just stay home and, like, lay around. But, I don't know, I was just, like, stressed out because of senior year and trying to get everything organized. Then balancing, like, two jobs and then... Um, just personal things too, like, I don't know. I've been dealing with some personal things, like I told you on the last video, um, that I don't really want to talk about on here, but, um, I don't know, like I said, I've just been going through a little rough time, and then, like, traveling, I, if you guys didn't know, I was in Florida, um, my, to visit schools, and, also, my grandpa is now in assistant living, and, because he's not, like, he can't live on his own anymore, if you guys, I mean, I'm sure you guys knew what assistant living meant, but, um, yeah, he's in assistant living now, so they had to move his furniture out on, out of his house and do all that stuff. Um, but it was nice to get away, I really did need that, it, like, helped me a lot. Like, just to have a change of scenery. It made me feel better, like, and stuff. And then, like, you got people in your life where they act like they want to be in your life, and then they don't act like it. I don't know. I don't know. People confuse me. People have been confusing me a lot lately, actually. Like, it's like one day they treat you like you're special, and then the next day they treat you like nothing. Like one day you're like best friends, and the next day you're not. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know. But, 
Um, other than that, I mean, I don't know. Let me update you on the life. Um, well, I'm in National Honor Society because I feel like that'd be like a good distraction for me. I mean, for homeschooling, you don't do anything really. Like, cause I, before I even did it, cause I didn't even wanna like, cause I was like, okay, well, how am I supposed to do this when I have two jobs and like worship team and everything else I have going on in my life? Like, I really don't have time to do like extra crap. So, I asked one of my teachers, and she said, um. She said, no, like, you guys, like, you don't have to do anything except, like, sell candy. And, like, I, as, like, she, I'm like, well, do you have to go to any, like, events or anything? And she's like, the only event you have to attend is your induction. I'm like, okay, good, because I'm like, I literally don't have time to do, like, all these extra activities and stuff. Because I'm already working, like, two jobs, so I really can't do that. And she's like, no. So, I'm currently, um, so yeah, I'll be in, I made it in, um, so I got my, um, letter that I was accepted and everything and stuff. Um, I'm hoping my poem placed, and if it didn't, then it didn't, but that would be cool. I don't know if they're gonna send me a letter or an email or what, but, I don't know. That's so good, especially when it's so cold. And my house is cold. Like, well, it's probably just me. Because my dad has my heat on. Has the heat on, but I'm just uh, always cold. I'm pretty sure I'm anemic, but we just never get that checked out. Because why not? I don't know why we don't, but we don't. Um, But, I mean, I have, like, sy symptoms of it. And... Like, um, I mean, I do show symptoms of it, like, my lips get purple, my fingernails get purple, um, I get tired easily, um, what else? Yeah, and, like, my nails will start, after they get purple, they'll start to turn white, like, um, what else? There's a couple other signs that I saw. It's probably because I'm underweight too. I should I should weigh a whole bunch more than I should, but my um camera stopped recording because I forgot to delete the videos that were on here. Um but yeah, like um what was I saying? I don't even know. Yeah, I think I'm anemic. I don't know though. I'm not a doctor, so I mean if I had a guess that's what I think I would be. Um so yeah. Florida was really fun. I got to go to the beach. Um, yeah, I like got to go to the beach. I got to try the ever so famous checkers. I don't know if you guys know what that is, but my dad like always like raves about it. He's like, hey, that's like you have to go to that if you're going. Like, he's like, you have to go to checkers before you leave because it's honestly the best. I mean. It's good, but it's not as good as, like, he, I thought I was going to get, like, an amazing, like, 100 out of 10 cheeseburger. Like, I thought it was going to be the best thing in the world. But, I mean, I've had better burger. I mean, it was okay. I mean, it wasn't, like, that as, as amazing as he made it sound. I don't know. But I still love my dad. Um, does anybody else hate mind games? Like, I literally hate mixed signals. Like... No matter what, if it's like friendships or like even driving, <laughs> um, even family, like anything, like anything. I just hate mixing rules. Like I rather people just be straight up with me than like not give me just give me mixed signals. Like like just tell me the truth. Tell me what you're thinking. Like. I mean, I basically like I guess. Don't sugarcoat it is the message. Like, I'd rather you guys, like, if you think I look bad in a shirt, then tell me. Like, or if you don't want to be in my life, tell me. Like, uh, instead of, like, saying, oh, I don't know. Even, like, front, like, front, like, that's, like, I don't know. I haven't really experienced mixed signals, but... Yeah. <laughs>
I know, it's probably too early for hot cocoa, but I need to get warm. Hot chocolate, I should say. Um, yeah, I just hate mixed signals, no matter what it comes from. Family, friendships, anything. Like, just be real with me. Yeah, September wasn't a good month for me, to be honest. I had a sucky September, so I hope October blesses me. Because, man, September was rough. Next Friday, I get my senior pictures done, which I'm super excited. Which I might vlog that day, because I have a lot to do. Because I'm visiting a school. I'm visiting a school, and I'm visiting, and then I'm getting my makeup hair done. I don't think I'm getting my nails done on the same day, or my eyebrows done on the same day. Because I'd just be too much to put in one day before my pictures. Because my pictures are at 5.30. So I think I'm going to do nails and eyebrows last. But um, let me know if you guys want a, um, a whatchamacallit, a, what was I going to say? Let me know if you guys want weekly vlogs. I don't know if I'll promise weekly vlogs because my life is really not that interesting. I hardly ever go out because like, like, here's my problem. Like, people think I'm this, like, loner person that, like, has no friends. I really do have friends, but they're all in college. Like, they're all older, and they're all in college, and that's my problem. They're all in college, and they're busy doing their schoolwork on the weekends and stuff, or they... So, like, I... Or they're away at college. Like, most of my friends are, like, away at college. I have, like, a couple that go here. But, I mean, they're busy with their lives, and I just can't wait till I'm in college, so I'll meet more people. And then, like I said, at my old school, I don't really talk to anybody because you can't trust anybody at my old school because everybody just made fun of me there. So, not everybody, but a lot of them. And then you just, like, lose touch with people. I mean, everybody's busy with seeing the people who I still talk to, like... You know, they're busy with their senior year, and they're busy working and stuff, so. And like I said, I have two jobs, so by the time I get home, like, I don't feel like doing anything. Like, especially on, after my Saturday shifts at my one job, like, literally, like, they're like nine hours, nine to ten hour shifts, and the last thing I want to do is go out when I was just on my feet for... 10 hours like literally my job at my one like both jobs actually which I don't care like but I mean, it gets tiring you know um at both jobs like I'm on my feet constantly so I mean obviously you get tired for being on your feet like especially when you're on your feet all day but um I'll be right back I'm gonna do my eyeliner hopefully it won't take long and then we could finish off the all right so I'm back um, yes, wing eyeliner had to give me trouble. Um, so yeah, um, I realized I forgot to name the eyeshadows, but I'll probably put them on the screen. Um, I'm debating, I was debating if I should do my face makeup, but then I'm like, um, because I'm debating if I'm going to work out or not. Um, kind of want to just stay in bed and watch Netflix, because I'm in like an iffy mood today, and... I don't know, I feel like there's nothing wrong with that, but then again, I'm going to eat Olive Garden tonight with my family for my sister's birthday, because that's like her favorite restaurant, so I probably should go work out so I can burn off all the calories I already ate today, and then I could just peg out on my fettuccine Alfredo, but I don't know. But anyway, um, now I'm doing, um, whatchamacallit, um, check very rarely that or foundation unless I want to bring out my inner makeup artist and um wear a full face because I don't know I try not to wear foundation a whole lot and like full face like I like usually most days I wear no makeup um unless I'm going out to do something major like even when I work at my one job at the spa, like, I usually just am so lazy and just put on eyeliner, mascara, and concealer and call it a day because I just don't feel like putting on makeup. I wear a full face because, I don't know, I feel like it's not me. I could feel like I'm not real. Oh, 
It's not the real Haley if I wear a like full face like every day. I mean, there's nothing wrong if you do that, but like, I don't know. I try not to. And especially, it just all depends. Like, like I said, it all depends on what I'm doing that day. Cause it, most days I like go to the gym, so I'm not gonna put on foundation. I only just do my. If anything, if I do decide to do makeup, I only do my eyes. I don't put any face makeup on. So if I do go to the gym today, I'm probably going to have to end up taking this off because I'm not wearing foundation and contour to the gym and highlight to the gym. Did I just screw up my eyeliner? I don't know. But yeah, it's very rarely that I wear foundation. I don't even wear it like every week. Just whenever I'm in the mood. And I don't even wear it because I'm insecure. It's just because I like like makeup and I like putting it on. Um, also, I like just experimenting and like... Okay, I might not be putting on foundation today because I can't get this open from the... Okay, did it work? Did it work? Okay, cool. Um... But yeah, like I said, there's nothing wrong if you wear foundation every day and, I mean, contour your face and all that every day. That's totally cool with me because I'm not a makeup shamer. I hate when people makeup shame like, eh, that girl wearing too much makeup. No, like, wear as much as you want. It's just, I don't like putting in that much effort every day. I, like, praise people who, like, have to, how, like, could put it on, like, Every day. And I know you're not supposed to dot this all over your face, but you know what? It's easier for me instead of having it on my brush. I just feel like it just evenly distributes easily, if you know what I mean. Um, but yeah, kudos to you if you wear full face every day, because I honestly don't have the energy to do that. Neither, nor have the energy to do my eyeshadow half the time, like literally, like... Like I said, during the week, mostly I just wear, like, um, eyeliner on the bottom, and then mascara, and then concealer, or no makeup at all. Lately, like, I haven't worn, like, like I said, usually full faces are on the weekend if I feel like it, and that's only if I'm not working at the spa, and, yeah. Um... I hate foundation because it gets all over the place. I This is why I never do foundation, but I did it for you guys because, you know, sometimes I do. This is not even part of my everyday, so I don't know why I put foundation on. But I guess since we're going out to dinner and going out to Olive Garden, I feel like I have to look a little more presentable because it's a fancy restaurant, so I feel like I can't just go show up in there with no makeup on it's like i know that's one thing that's bad about me i don't have like an in between with my makeup well i guess i kind of do if i do the eyeshadow eyeliner mascara but like it's either like full face or like no makeup at all i don't know like look at this foundation is way too pale for me i promise you it's gonna get better once i put on my concealer and bronzer i just like going paler for my foundation so when it oxidizes I don't have to deal with me looking like Noompa Loompa. Um, another thing I wanted to bring up to you guys is um, wow this really makes me look like a ghost on camera. I promise you this is not flashback Mary. I promise you like it's all gonna look good after like it looks so bad on camera like look at like but that is like the color of my neck. Like that matches my neck perfectly. I promise you in person it's not as white as it looks. But anyway, um yeah. Um what was I saying? Oh, another thing that I wanted to bring up to you guys is about my Fenty Beauty review. Okay, so I don't so as you guys saw in the last video, um whatchamacallit, you saw that my highlighter was broken, so Friday I, um, I, uh, whatchamacallit, Friday, I went back, returned that, um, and of course they didn't have it in the store, so I had to reorder again, so let's pray that I don't get another broken highlighter. I got another sponge.
Yeah, I'm not feeling wearing foundation. Like, my skin looks gross underneath it. Like, I don't know. Like, I just don't like how it looks today. I mean, it looks fine on camera, but what I'm seeing in person, I just don't like. And I decided that I'm probably, if I have time after this video, I am going to go, um the gym so I don't know why I even put this foundation on I never put foundation on but um, I don't know see you guys it's starting to look better already I don't look like Casper the ghost um, uh, there's so many things I have to do before my senior pictures I don't know why I'm putting on more makeup, but I'm just going to be taking this off. Uh -uh. Yes, hunty. Get those extra cheekbones. <laughs> I mean, carve out those cheekbones. Slimmer face instantly. I have such chubby cheeks. I can't wait to watch that video. I was like 13 or 14 in that. I didn't even realize that was the SIM card that I used. I'm glad I found it because now I can make a video while one sitting instead of having to wait for the other one to upload on my computer. Those cheekbones are coming alive. Did I forget to bring? Yes, I did. So I'm just going to have to do the whole rubbing in my hand things not make it as harsh then with blush and uh, actually I didn't bring a blush brush out so I guess there's no blush today well we'll just go straight to highlight my life right there um we're gonna just go straight to highlight I guess I don't know. I might not even go to the gym now. I don't know. I don't think I have time to go to the gym. Actually, looking at the time, I don't think I do. Because, I don't know. Because I probably should edit this and then do some of my math homework. And then log my gym hours. So, I don't know. I just, I don't know. All I know, I'm getting this foundation off ASAP because I hate foundation and this is why I don't wear it every day and this is why I wear it like zero to two times every other week. <laughs> I only wear it like once or twice like every other week or every two weeks. Dude, uh, this has been my favorite lipstick to use with this eyeshadow look. I finally, like, I was using another lip but <laughs> honey, that got replaced real quick. Now I'm gonna put on my lips. On for Nikki Nude. The moment for you guys all been waiting for. Literally, these lipsticks, Pink Print and Nikki Nude, are 10 out of 10. I literally love them. Pigmented, yeah, pigmentation, 10 out of 10. Formula, 10 out of 10. Like, I'm obsessed with these, and you guys need to get your hands on them if you can. I know at my MAC counter, we have a ton left over. So, I mean, it's possible that other MACs have them left over, a lot left over. And that is my completed. Fall makeup routine. Again, I don't wear this much makeup every day, so if you're going to judge me and say you wear too much makeup, I don't. Um, again, you got to remember, makeup is legit my hobby. Um, I look at it as an art because I suck at everything else that involves art, unless painting. Painting I'm actually pretty good at, but I suck at drawing and stuff. And um, also, I don't wear make this much makeup every day. Um, most days I just wear eyeliner, uh, no, most days I wear, like, no makeup at all, unless I'm, 
legit going somewhere. Um, and then sometimes I'll mix it up with eyeliner, mascara, and concealer, or I usually during, I usually most days I wear just focus on my eyes, and then of course do my eyeliner and eyebrow. I mean my concealer and eyebrows, but um. Like I said, I don't wear foundation, I don't contour and highlight every day, and when I do it's just because I love makeup so much, and makeup is my passion, it's an art to me, it's not to cover up, I don't do this to cover up myself or whatever, it's really just because I love, it's just fun for me to put on makeup, but um, yeah, I don't wear this much full face makeup every day, it's just, um, yeah, so the technically it's not my everyday makeup routine, but like I said, it all depends on my mood and what I'm doing, but you guys get the gist. The eyeshadow look and the eyes are pretty much my everyday makeup look, but the face, not really. Um, like I said, most days I do concealer and that's it. Like, but today I'm going, I'm doing, uh, having a special occasion, so I had to look a little fancier and I'm probably not going to twerk out because it's actually kind of late and it's actually kind of pointless if I'm going out and so uh, why would I take this off if I'm going to Olive Garden but um yeah so don't judge me I don't wear face makeup every day most of the days it's just clear no makeup on my face at all except concealer um but I don't I don't even know no I need to stop explaining myself because one I've repeated myself like a million times Two, who cares? Like, I just feel like people think it's unattractive if you don't wear makeup. Like, not that I need people, not that I need to be attractive. That's a, the wrong word that I meant to use. I meant to use a different word. Um, not unattractive. I feel like people, like, think it's wrong. No, I don't know what word I'm thinking of. But I feel like people judge you if you wear a ton of makeup, so... That's why I try to just stick with the eyes and make them pop and just do that and nothing else. Because um, in my ear, people like to judge you if you wear a ton of makeup. I don't know why. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And go follow my beauty Instagram at underscore. Haley's Beauty underscore. I love you guys so much and thanks for watching guys. Bye!